welcome back and it's been a while that i haven't made a tweak videos and finally i'm back and today i have got you another top 10 side idea tweaks and they are very awesome and they are very useful as well and i hope you like this video and now let's jump straight into the first tweak now let's jump into the first tweak and you may see the tweaks from the intro so the tweaks is very simple it will add the screen server to your iphone um, ipod or ipad so all you have to do after you um, install the tweak um, you can go to settings so you can see the screen server after i tap on the screen one time it will go to the lock screen you can see here so now let um, let me unlock my phone then i can go to settings then i can go to sleep server and you can see we have a widow so you can choose a widow to um, set as a screen server and you can enable while you are in low power mode so even though you are in low power mode you can um, enable these tweaks as well if you don't want to consume more battery you can disable this button so it's mean that when your phone is in low power mode um, the tweaks doesn't enable so it is very awesome and you can set the fade duration and repeat amount as well and now i can choose a video you need to remember the tweaks only work for the video so it doesn't work on photos you can choose a video that you have record or you can download from the internet let's say i want to choose this video i can um, just um, click on choose and then it will compress a video and now i can go back to my um, lock screen now you can see screen server is up here let's go to the next one this is the tweak that allows you to customize the color switch button so it does change the switch button color so you just enable the tweaks and we have color for disable and color for enable so you can select um, the color for disable button so i can just um, drag this bar and then this is the color for disable and i can select for enable and then we can just um, apply and hit on OK. Now go back to settings and you can see the um, button here. So this is the color for disable button. And when I enable it, you can see the color has been changed. So we have two color. If you take a look closely on my iPhone 8 status bar, you can see on the left side. Um, instead of the carrier you can see um, the date so we have full date so this is the tweak that add more um, additional information to your iPhone H status bar so it is very simple you just um, go to settings and then you can set the date so now let's go to settings and I'll go to the tweaks so we have line 1 and line 2 and we have two options um, we also have a sample as well you need to go to this um, website so now go to Safari and I can type an S date format. You can see here and I'll go to this uh, website and then we have sample for the um, extra information as well. Now here it is. So you can see the sample here. So um, for the first one that I mentioned, it is um, this one and you can just copy the sample so let's go um, to this one i can only want to see the number so you can copy this one copy and now go back to settings and you can paste it here so we have the shortcut so you just paste this one and i can hit on the turn key and then we need to respring Now you can see the date here. So instead of um, the full date, we have the number. Dynamic wallpaper line. It allows you to inject the wallpaper into settings app. So it is very simple. So you just go to this app. And this one, it is a live version. So it means it doesn't a full version. And if you want to get a full version, you can purchase it on Sidea. And you can see the live version here. So we have, um, we have between light mode and dark mode. So you need, um, you need to choose two wallpapers. So I choose uh, for, let's choose for the light mode. And I can select um, um, this one. And then for dark mode, let's go to um, another one. Here we go. And then you can see we have um, two wallpapers, light and dark mode. 
and then we can click on create you can set the title for wallpaper let's say um, iPhone SE now click on OK and you can see um, it is successfully um, created so we can go to settings and now you can go to wallpaper and choose a new wallpaper click on still and if you scroll all the way down you can see your new wallpaper here so we have between light mode and dark mode if you have dark mode in the ball it will choose the dark mode wallpaper however if you have um, dark mode disabled you will see the light uh, wallpaper you can see here so it does change depend on your um, dark mode and light mode so it is depend on when you disable or enable dark mode save send email the tricks ask you before you send an email so for example if I go to email and when I click on reply and if I click on send and you can see it will ask me before I um, before the email is sent you can see here it is also useful as well sometimes you accidentally click on the send button so the tweaks will ask you the confirmation first before you send an email cover flow music so the tweaks let you have the ios um, style on music app so if you go to your music library so when you um, put your phone in landscape mode you can see we have an old style from iOS 6 and you can scroll across the music and you can click on it to play the music or you can go to forward or go to the previous song and you have a bunch of style as well you can go back to settings and you can select the style and we have a ton of them here so let's go to time machine and I can go back to music and now we have a new style as well so we have time machine let's go to iOS 8.3 and now we have a new style from iOS 8 this brand new tweak allows you to invoke spotlight so from anywhere on your phone let's say um, now I'm standing on the app store so I can invoke spotlight by long press and you can see spotlight pop up or I can swipe to the right and you can see spotlight also pop up or I can swipe to the left spotlight also pop up as well or I can save my device and you can see spotlight also appear so we can quickly access to spotlight from anywhere on the phone and it is much um, quicker if you want to open another application or you can search and you can go to settings and here are the uh, four gestures here to invoke spotlight you can also slide down with two fingers so it will bring up the spotlight Wolf will add additional feature to Facebook so if you open Facebook let's go to Facebook and then you can click on more and you can see Wolf pop up and you can click on it and then we have additional feature um, where you can um, disable marking messages or disable typing status and it will have more function so with the new update so you can wait for the new update for more features and functions better widgets let you customize widgets on your phone and i think i did a video on this as well but now we have a new update on better widgets so i think i want to include this one and then you can see a lot of functions so you can go to square widgets and you can set the um, transparent widget and it does only work on ios 13 only and you can remove the header text and you can enable a custom text as well or you can set the blur background or you can choose the custom wallpaper and then you can respring after respring let's go to widgets and you can see the widget turn to square and the background is a blur so let me add more widget and you can see here the background and the widget turn to square last but not least so let's go to safari and as you can um, go to any web and you can see the background is removed so the trick is very simple it just um, completely remove the search bar and you can see there is no background for the search bar finally thanks for watching i hope you like all of these tweaks and then we'll catch you guys in the next one and we'll include more tweaks and if you want to get this wallpaper and the theme i also include in the description this is a demo theme and the wallpaper it is from the iphone se2 in 2020